I lost my way. With no surface bars, no Wi-Fi in range, I really hadn't the slightest idea which way to turn. Something had gone wrong, and all we could click up were those 300 loser channels we never watched. I simply could not locate that must-have on sale e-toy of my dreams, though I saw that others had. I grew confused by the media hydra of conflicting opinions, all spewed out as gospel and patriotic truth. I could not find our cart amid what seemed to be thousands of crowded and labyrinthic Walmart aisles. Stumbling clumsily through the, all the rubble, I noticed it did not matter any more which way I turned. One day, mouthing buzz phrases, I didn't know if I was a progressive liberal or some conservative hardliner. Suddenly, one evening, stuck on the freeway, I realized no exit could ever take me home again. Got hammered and woke up parked by a smelly, overflowing dumpster at some run-down apartments. Lost my way, staring into the sun, pilgrimaging through their fly-plagued and God-forsaken desert holy lands. Tried believing each and every political ad, but that only led me into a maze of hilarious contradictions. Riding my new ATV out on BLM lands, I strayed off into a tangle of God-fearing libertarian bandit trails. Grew confused, wondering why there was so much hatred between so many, so similar religious sects. Never could locate those 1% CEOs scuttling off roach-like to hide beneath a dark corporate anonymity. Wasn't sure who to turn to when my kids stopped being my friend and my wife got the menopause. When I received my diagnosis, I suddenly realized how alone I was, right in the middle of everybody. After my fourth layoff and downsizing, I considered I might be off the path to that happily ever after. When my doctor and insurance company both cut me off, I turned to a faith in God for all my ills and bills. Grew ever more bewildered just trying to obey that needlessly massive and criminally cryptic tax code. When alcohol failed to comfort me, I groped in wild desperation for my own mass media personal savior tit. Blinded for years by the lies of a liberal media, I was barely able to see the light of right-wing gospel. The issues all seemed very complex, but luckily the pithy tweets of trusted media leaders led me through. I couldn't locate the hated enemy's land on a map, but I knew our drones would find their evil targets. In a moment of deathbed lucidity, I saw the endless sails of the very latest had led me only to this. Couldn't figure out why. Though all the boxes and cans got smaller, the prices were not lowered at all. Never understood how so many people kept living in filth on a dollar a day without any hope at all. Didn't make sense that the government subsidized snack foods and paid for my diabetes and SSDI as well. Quit trying to figure out why our spending power decreased even while heroic CEs grew ever richer. Got lost in the acres of giant pickups, each parked and ready to clumsily haul one fat commuter around. Never again was the man I only thought I had been before I blew out my knee unloading groceries. Went astray in my pursuit of individual happiness, what with all the noise, smoke, litter, and neon lights. Did not see how bursting into girls' elementary schools with AK-47s blazing punished the great Satan. Finally got time to go over to Ma's, but it was like all dark and dirty, like nobody'd been there for months. When I momentarily lost my faith, I was quickly paralyzed by scores of painfully conflicting sound bites. I'm pretty damn sure that lotto ticket I lost last year was my triple pick retirement funding winner. So with all the confusion in the herd, it was no real surprise that I lost my own personal sense of direction as well.